This day is very it's, it's speechless right now, but um, I've been looking forward. Well, college football was never like a goal set for me, but um, academics, going to college was always put in my mind. So um, when um, coaches believed and told me that I could succeed in football, college football, um, I saw it as an opening to pay for my school. So um, I just worked hard and succeeded in what I could do. And um, right now I'm just speechless. I can't really find the words to express. I wish I could. I had them all earlier, but um, right now I'm just speechless. All his aggressiveness, you know, he got, he's very aggressive. He comes off the ball very low. Uh, he worked on his skills very hard from last year to this year. So much improvement. And obviously with his size and his uh, upside, uh, his potential is something that is it's huge. You know, and I, you can't coach six foot four, 280 pounds. So. Basically, the, the reason um, I picked Abilene Christian is because they made me, make me feel at home. They um, came down to visit me. They they made that um, that step to make me feel like I want was wanted. And they just um, instead of me having to go up there, I already know how the tour, the campus, and all of that looks. Um, they brought their place to me, so it made me feel I'm more at home. All colleges look at. at at competitors and they want to see that they like to compete you know if they're competitors they like to compete in every form or fashion whether they can compete in track basketball football they like to see guys do more than one thing and uh, and, and do good at it um, coach columns the basic basically he told me um, they're excited that they got me and um, um, they put a large amount of money into me obviously and that just he was expecting to me for me to work my butt off in the off season and in the seasons to come he expects to put, put <laughs> he expects me to put forth all the all the effort and ounce of blood and tear and everything I got in me. Absolutely, no doubt. You know, his hard work and uh, his work ethic and his competitiveness obviously rubs off on the rest of our kids. And, uh, um, you know, we want to set the bar high, we want to set our goals high, and then uh, and shoot for the stars. And that's what we teach our kids. And get all you can out of life and, and your education and everything else. So, um, you know, he's definitely done well for himself, and hopefully he will be an inspiration to the rest of these kids. Um, well, first of all, I want to get my diploma so as if I get hurt in any other sport I have something to fall back on but um, my goal when I'm up there is just to do the best I can and try to try to become that number one spot first string playing and hopefully um, if I work hard enough and put in up the effort I'll be playing at the next level well um, I had to talk to coach Collins about um, about considering to do track because I do shot put and discus so um, he said it was possible for me to do that if it wasn't going to interfere with, uh, with my weights and my football career over there